It's that time of year again. We get to go out there and paint some love all across our community, Sunday, June 5th. Uh, it is one of our favorite weekends and we're gonna gather here. We're gonna have a little bit of music and some prayer before we launch out into about 30 different projects to show our community some love. I'm Krista Langer. This is my husband, Chad Langer. Um, we've been at PCC for a, about a year and a half. Um, part of the reason we changed churches was that we were having trouble getting connected at our last church. And um, we were still kind of a work in progress on getting connected here when Serve Day came around. And it ended up that that was how it, all the pieces fell into place for getting connected. Checking out Serve Day, we, we chose to do Lake Camelot. And we spent the day picking up trash, picking up weeds, fellowshipping and we got plugged in. We found a great subgroup and it, it changed our year. We were a little concerned if our small children would work on serve day, but our two-year-old daughter and our five-year-old son had a great time. We recommend this day for families of all ages and abilities. There are projects from picking up trash, to kayaking and picking up shorelines, to painting fences. All abilities are welcome. If you're interested in getting better connected at church, serve day is a great way to do that. We hope that you will connect with each other on Serve Day, that you'll make some new friendships while you're out there serving. The City of Plymouth has really come to count on us and they look forward to our annual Serve Day. So this year, they will have some trail cleanups again, but in addition to that, they're doing a call out. They want us to bring our kayaks and our waders and do some shoreline cleanups. They are looking for us to do some scraping and painting to some fairly large projects and so we hope that you'll consider um, rolling up your sleeves and showing up and, and just really painting some love across our city.